Dinner Life with my main man, Pastor Robert Aiken. How you doing, Pastor? Hey, praise the Lord, Apostle, and the KAZ Radio TV audience. God bless you. God is good. All I can say is Wendians. We didn't wear our jerseys Uh-oh. this week. Not rock, <laughs> but the Indians, first pitches in about 10 minutes. They are 88 and 56, the best record in the American League, the best record in the Central Division. The 19 game winning streak, one more win, Lady B. 20 wins matches the Oakland A's. A's, and they set the record in when? 2005? 2005. 2005. There yeah, it is. Lady B's hit me with his sports talk here on The Light. It's the live internet TV show of True Light Church. The church is located in the beautiful city of Cleveland, Ohio, 1799 East 55th Street, three blocks south of 55th and Superior, the McDonald's and Burger King's on the corner. It's The Light every Sunday, 1130 a.m., 10 a.m. is our life classes, and I got to give you our lineup. On Tuesdays, we have the CA meetings at 7 p.m. On Tuesday, we're here live in the studio right here in Cleveland, Ohio. We're live at KAZ Radio TV doing our show, The Light. Then tomorrow night, come check us out. New Life in Christ is our interactive family corporate prayer interactive teaching and learning of the word amen then on thursday the aa meetings at 7 p.m fabulous friday nights at 7 p.m and our community outreach is at 12 p.m on saturday we've got our ministries the 25 35 ministry evangelism ministry we believe in telling people about jesus our prison ministry marriage ministry singles ministry men of excellence we're getting ready for men's season in october and so we're in the midst of it seeds of a woman our woman's ministry our tv radio ministry Hashtag RVA Ministries and the second time around. Hit us up, True Light Church 55th at gmail.com. We're rolling into women's season. There are the shirts for women's season. Praise the Lord. On the back, it says, Soul Seeds of a Woman. We're super excited. Want you to come down. We're going to be telling you all about the service. It's the power of love. It's women's season at the light. We kick it off this Friday with my girl, my Michelle, my Winnie, my Coretta Scott, my boo <laughs> thing, the brown sugar girl is going to be preaching and teaching the gospel. 7 p.m. this Friday, 7 p.m. All amen, roads lead to True Light Church. We're on tiptoe anticipation this Friday. We kick off our women's season 2017 with Lady B speaking a word of encouragement into the women's lives. 7 p.m. this Friday, the first 50 women. We got a special guest, a special gift for you. And then check this out, women. I'll be at the door greeting everybody that comes in. If you say you saw us on KAZ Radio TV, we got a super special gift for you, amen? So come check us out this Friday. We're kicking off our women's season Friday, September 15th, right, Lady V, 7 p.m.? 7 p.m. Then next Friday, September 22nd, is Elder Danielle Dorch from Dunham Christian Church, powerful woman of God. And then we culminate on Sunday, that will be September 24th at our 11.30 a.m. worship service with Judge Cassandra Collier-Williams, Cuyahoga County Common Pleas Judge. Three powerful speakers in one location. Man, I'm on tiptoe anticipation like a fat kid loves cake like a kid on Christmas. <laughs> Amen. It's women's season at the light, man. I get it out. It's women's season oh at the light. Goodness. Hey, Sports Talk, we're going to roll with you today at 720. We're dedicating the show to Lady V and women's season. It's women's Praise season God. at the light. It's the we're power excited. of love. Ephesians 4 2 is our theme. Lady V, we're going to talk to I'm going to bring you right here and there. The Indians. 20, they set a record first pitch. We're nine minutes away. Nope, we're seven minutes away from the first pitch. And y'all know who's going tonight, Apostle Lady V, my main man, Corey Kluber. That's my man, Corey Kluber. He's so cool on the mound. He's so calm on the mound. Nothing rattles Corey. He's already ready. He comes in at 15-4 and four with an ERA of 2.6. Lady V, putting you on the spot. What does ERA mean? Did you do some homework? I did not, and yeah, you I did know put you me did. on the spot. I know it. I know it, Apostle. <laughs> I got her. She knows her stuff, though. The girl don't sleep on her. ERA is earn run average. ERA, little sports talk, little teaching, too. Amen. <laughs> Praise God. Hey, the Browns did it. The Browns did it. I almost predicted. Y'all know it. I was real close, 21 to 18. So now what I got to do in my fantasy football league, Lady V and Apostle and listen audience, I got – my man again, I got Antonio Brown on my fantasy football team. I did it back-to-back years, Ray, Derek, Stevie J, man. I know you're tripping. But they said since the Browns won, I got to rep my Antonio Brown jersey on KAZ Radio TV. I apologize. I had a crazy busy day. 
I'm a man of my word. Next Tuesday, I'll rep by Antonio Brown. I'm the biggest Browns fan. I'm the biggest Indians fan since 1964 I was born. My mom and dad told me I went to my first game. Shout out to my brother-in-law, Eugene Jones. He's in glory. They took me. I was three years old. 1967, I raised in a sports family. We just love sports. So I'm a man of my word. Ray, Derek, Stevie J, all my buddies who watch the show. I will rep the jersey next week, Antonio Brown. We'll talk a little fantasy football, too. Browns look good, 21-18, and my man Kaiser was the man. I like his style. I like his flow. I told y'all the rookie was ready. Shout out to Deacon Quinn, Coach Q, and Big Everett. They said they didn't know. Don't play the boy yet. No, I'll put the boy in there. Let him get his bumps and bruises. He will be all right. I got to read some of his stats, man, because it really pumped me up. I'm talking about my guy, Deshaun Kaiser out of Notre Dame. He was 20 for 30. Lady V, he passed 30 times, 20 times they caught the ball for 222 yards. Not bad for a rookie. One touchdown, one interception. He was sacked seven times, but still, yeah. that's my man. But wait a minute. I got to give Ray, Derek, Stevie J. Oh, I got to get a statistic. Antonio Brown, 11 receptions, 182 yards, 16.5 average. My fantasy foot back to back. I got A, B. All right, they know what I'm talking about. They cracking up. They're going to get me. I will rip the jersey next week. I apologize. Was really busy today. Lady V, I got to bring you in. I'm super excited. We're going to dedicate the show at 720. We normally do word power, but we're going to dedicate the show to women's season at the light. Yeah, now you got to tell me a little bit. Nope, nope. I got to know the nah. question of the day. The question of the oh, day. Oh, the question of oh, the day. Oh, Apostle, listen, whoa, audience. This is a good whoa, whoa. one. Listen to the question of the day. Lady James, Pastor Rosina Coles, listen to the question for the day, man. Pastor Lenora Clark, listen to the question <laughs> for today. Watch this. What does it mean for uh -huh. a wife to submit to her husband? Ooh. And is it difficult to fall under submission? Ooh, the S word, submission. Submission. Apostle Lady V, I married a couple. No names, of course. The wife told me, take that out of your verbiage. She said, Pastor, wow. I don't want you to say the word submission. I said, I I've got to say it, Apostle. It's biblical. I've had, I've married couples who have told me, you know, they, they I had one couple I didn't marry. No disrespect. I wow. have counseling sessions. I do three if you're not in the church, seven if you're a member of the church. But Apostle, we was halfway through and she was adamant about it, Apostle. She said she didn't want the word submission. She didn't want me to say it at all. So the question of the day, is it hard to submit? Is it hard to submit? Put you on the hot seat. What about you coming up to be a wife? Is it hard to submit? It is not. Praise God. Amen. You didn't ask me why. Why? Because you script. can fall you fall up under God. Praise God. You submit to God. You submit to Christ. Order. As Christ submits to God. So it's a structure. Order. What I taught it's on order. last month. Praise God. What's the order? The order is the hus the uh, wife submits to the husband. Gotcha. Okay. The husband submits to Christ. Is this biblical or lady theology? This is biblical. Okay, all right. Okay. <laughs> the wife, I got her. The I got wife her. Submits I got her. Okay, the wife submits. To the husband. Gotcha. The husband submits to Christ. Gotcha. Guess who Christ submits to? God the Father. Wow. Praise the Lord. That's order. The question of the day is about submission. What about the meaning of submission? Because I know you were started. It? You it's look an it action up? word. It's an action word. Yeah, submission is an action word. Okay, you're, you're yielding. You're coming up under authority. Coming up under authority. Coming up under authority. You're yielding wow. to authority. Praise God. That wow. is a powerful question of the day. Y'all got to hit us up on the question of the day. That is real powerful. I love it. I love it. 707, we're three minutes away from the first pitch. My main man, Clory Kluber, is on the mound. The Indians are going to try to set, tie the record of 20 straight wins, man. We got to be super excited. The Browns are looking good, and it's almost NBA time. I can't wait, man. Shout out to Kyrie Irving, man. I can't wait to come back. We're going to crush them, man. We're going to crush the Boston <laughs> Celtics in that first game. Praise God, man. I'm so excited. Hey, this is for my man who asked me, his wife asked me, she said, the book of the month, Rev. What about the book of the month? We're still on it. This is our fourth straight broadcast talking about the book of the month. We try to read a book a month. The book I'm recommending to all men is Tony Evans. Dr. Tony Evans out of Oak Cliff Bible Fellowship Church in Dallas, Texas. It is called Kingdom Man. And listen to this. It says, every man's destiny, every woman's dream. Over 200,000 copies sold worldwide. And I was just watching Dr. Evans on the Word Network. He was preaching a series on Kingdom Man. So all my kingdom men get the book. 
I'm going to get a parcel of copy. I promise that too. Got to be a man of your word. I got to rep my AB jersey next Tuesday if it's the Lord will and the creek don't rise. I used to like when the old people say that. Oh Lord will and the creek don't rise. <laughs> so there it is. The book I'm reading, I'm still in. This is the fourth week. We told you about it four weeks ago. Lady V, what's your book? And mine is The Battlefield of the Mind. The Battlefield of the wow. Mind. Wow. You know what? And this is why some of us can't submit as Ooh, wives. Jesus. Because the thoughts that are in our mind, wow. and, you know, our, our mind is confused about why we can't submit to our husbands. But right. there's a reason why. But you got to come check me out Friday. Right. Friday, 7 p.m. <laughs> we kick off our 2017 women's season. Hey, we're not that old. The church is our 63rd annual women's season. I've been rocking it now. This is my sweet 16. And hey, you got to come to the church. Everybody who watches us, check this out. Try to remember. I'll keep blowing it up. October the 1st at 3.30 p.m. Your boy celebrates 16 years of pastoral leadership. It's my 16th sweet 16 appreciation. And my covenant bishop, Bishop Eric Kincaid Clark, will be in the house, Baca, the body of Christ's assembly. And we're excited. That morning at 11 a.m., we're celebrating our 63rd church anniversary. So we're calling it 6316. At 11 a.m., I got the powerful man of God who preaches like Bishop Jakes, Pastor Gregory Manigault. He's on the wild, wild west, the west side of Cleveland at the <laughs> remnant house of God. That's the lineup. We're going to be telling you more about it. Stay with the books. You got to read it. Kingdom Man, Dr. Tony Evans. Lady V, what's your book? Battlefield of the Mind. It's that time. First pitch is about to happen, man. It's 17. Chloe Kluber and the Indians are taking the field right now. Nope. They're, yeah, they're taking the field right now. They did the uh, Pledge of Allegiance. They're taking the flag. Hey, check this out. My boys told me we got to talk about Colin Kaepernick. You know, I'm going to be on that next week. We're going to be doing some more social justice, too. Hey, he should be playing uh, in the NFL. We know that. But we're going to talk about that, too. It's 710. It's 720. We got some callers calling in. Some of the spiritual daughters going to be calling in. We're repping. We're pumping up our women's season. It's the power of love. Women's season 2017 at the light. Kicking it off this Friday night. Fabulous Friday night at the light, 7 p.m. Lady V is going to be preaching and teaching the gospel. Wait a minute. All the ladies going to be rocking their T-shirts. Man, they're really powerful. Look at the T-shirts. Got our beautiful logo on them. Got our website. It's up and going. Seeds of a woman. Let me get it right. Seeds of a woman at gmail.com. No, that's the Gmail. The website is coming. We're going to be breaking that to you in, in the next month. We're going to hit that in October. But there's the shirts. They're going to be repping the shirts. What you going to preach about? I want just a little bit. Just give it a listen, audience. Just a little bit, man. Man, some, uh, man, the power of love, just a little bit. Submission, authority, okay, I got you. But what you going to be talking about a little I bit? I can't tell. You got to come oh, out man. and see. 7-Eleven, you can't tell us. That's a, a, a little you. sneak Not preview. 7-Eleven. Huh? I, think I can tell you at 7 o'clock on September 15th, though. There you go. Praise God. Is this Friday, September 15th, 7 p.m. at the light. Where's the light? 1799 East 55th Street in the beautiful city of Cleveland, Ohio. We kick off our women's season. We'll be pumping it up for the rest of the show. And we're excited. Give them the question of the day, though. I like it. I like it. Why, as wives, as wives, can we submit to our husbands? And is it hard for us to fall up under submission? Just ask me one thing. We want the callers to call in. Callers, check us out. 216-298-1554. That number again is 216-298-1554. It's live here in the studio in the beautiful great city of Cleveland, Ohio on Burke Lakefront Airport. It's the KAZ Studios, and we got to tell you, wait, 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 before we go into word power, got to blow up my man, Apostle Larry James, in this powerful vehicle called, oh my God, called www.kazradiotv. It's a powerful vehicle, home of the last week. Somebody called me and asked me, Apostle, not $25. Apostle told me $0.25. Cent. They said, Pastor, that's unbelievable. <laughs> Check this out. Log on to www.kazradiotv. It's home. Of the 25 cent advertisement. advertisement. I checked it out too. <laughs> somebody didn't believe me. That's for somebody they know I'm talking about. They said that can't be right. That's right. Check out the website www.kazradiotv, home of the 25 cent advertisement. You got to do that. Shout out to Apostle James, his beautiful wife of this powerful vehicle, his ministry, his family, his grandbabies. He's a papa like me. He loves them grandbabies. And shout out to his covering bishop. Romy Coles, who will be with us at the light 
We're going to blow y'all away for men's season. We always have a contest of wow. men. Pa- here Apostle, we're going to blow here, them here, away. Here we go Listen again to my lineup. This. I got to give it to y'all before 7 Oh, now you want to oh cut me off because you know I'm about oh to come in. God. The month oh, of October. That's wrong, Pastor, Pastor. Greg Manigault, the remnant house of God. <laughs> Bishop Eric Kincaid Clark, the body of Christ. Bishop Romy Coles, the lion. Wayne Dawson Fox on Reverend Rain in the house. We're gonna blow the women you know away. What? That's why Y'all will be submissive. You, you know how God said He ch- He took and chose ordinary people to do extraordinary things. To do extraordinary things, you had to go out and get people who are. <laughs> I'm going somewhere. You had to go out and get people who are famous and you know hold I, status. Just, I'm and, like LeBron. I just said no, dream no, no, no. team. That's so called the dream he, team. He, he took an ordinary oh. girl from East Cleveland that graduated Cleveland from girl. Orange High wow. School in Pepper Pike. Wow. And did something extra extraordinary ordinary oh with her. God, the girl from East. I didn't C. know my my call or my life was gonna be in ministry. Wow, praise God. And I'm not even it. famous. But wow. you had to go out and get people who have status, you know, uh, Minister Wayne uh, Dawson of the Fox Bishop a, Romy Coles from the Channel Lion. A News. Right. And you can see him on CTC TV. I saw him on TCT television. Uh, Ask the pastor. Shout out to my main man, Bishop Coles, who always helps me when I call. The extraordinary will stand out. Bishop Eric Kincaid Clark Baca. Will stand out. The extraordinary okay. will stand out. All right. We're going to let y'all know on October 30th. On September 15th. All right. I'm going to cut you off too. September right. 15th. Right. It's Come out, down. Women. It's going down. It's going down, ladies. Y'all gotta it's be there. You down. know your boy is pumped. We the got power special love. Gift. The power Women's of love. Women's season, 2017 at True Light Church. Wow, there it 1799 is. East 55. And they're gonna be repping the t-shirts. I love them with everything on the front. I love the We're logo. We're gonna have a powerful praise. praise. Our designer. Powerful praise and worship that night. Yeah, man, powerful. Yes. We and got a some powerful kids word coming. Oh, and a powerful word. And the family. All my single there. ladies. Family, friends, all the single ladies. All my married women. On my second time around, Our women, second if you've been time divorced, around, come on out, amen. Divorced, single, married, been through widow, divorce, widowed. That's right. Praise God. All in all, just coming home from the institution. You know, I serve as a chaplain, coming home from that great big institution back into society. Come check us out at your no church. matter what your status is. That's right. That's right. I love this. Look what we <laughs> say in our True Light Church helps people restore their lives. Serve in the community with big on evangelism, grow stronger in a relationship with Jesus Christ. So as we draw closer to God, let us be committed, always be led by the power of the Holy Spirit to do kingdom work. All yes. are welcome at TLC because it's all about the love. Yes. So come as we show you our love so you'll be able to experience the power of love. Yes. Man. Praise Amen. God. Check us Amen. out. You got to check that out. Our websites are going to be dropping. Lady V says she talked to the designer. We're going to be dropping that in the 1st of October. We're always going to tell you about it. Uh, RVA Ministries, second time around, Seeds of a Woman, all that's going to be set up. Hey, call the church, 216-417-0749. Ask for Minister Jazz Lauderdale. She'll hook you up if you want a shirt and you want to come out and rep with us. You can get a shirt too, amen? So check us out. It's the light. Oh, man, the live internet broadcast here on KAZ Radio TV. It's 716 and man, the Indians are rolling right now. Question of the day. Give it to them one more time, Lady B. The big S word. Submission. Submission. Wow. Is it culture? Is it harder for an African-American woman to, um, I'm not playing any race cards. You know that the God's no respect or person. Is it harder, or I'm not pumping, is it harder for an African-American woman, a Latino woman, uh, to be submissive because of culture, circumstances, uh, things in life, but everybody's been through things. Is it harder for, uh, what I'm trying to say, yeah, I want to answer that, I want you to answer that question. Is it harder for an African-American woman or woman of color to be submissive? I'm not going to play uh, yeah. what your, your race is, but I was yeah. talking to uh, one of my coworkers, and he he said that is <clears throat> excuse me it's not about the race but he said mm-hmm. we have a problem as women women in general women in general okay. all right now we're back on women in general sub- being submissive because one it was never really taught to them they didn't see it okay. it wasn't in the I home like okay. and and it's hard for them to be led and and then he said the reason why is because they they've been through so much right. and they've acquired and came accustomed to things on okay. their own. I like that. I like so that. So okay. they don't know how to be, mm. to fall up under submission. Okay. Is it a pride thing or an accomplishment thing? Is it a pride thing or accomplishment thing and sometimes they can't fall up under submission, you think? Could be. 
could be? Wow, powerful question. It transcends color, it transcends race. Hey, call us up here at the studios live, KAZ Studios, 216-298-1554. That number again is 216-298-1554. It's 718, two more minutes, and we dedicate the show to our women's season. We're kicking it off three powerful speakers. This Friday, September 15th at 7 p.m., Lady V is going to rock the house. The next Friday, September 22nd, same time, same place, same back channel, same theme, same scripture. Elder Danielle Dorch from Dunham Christian Church will be our speaker. Then we culminate on Sunday morning. Uh, that will be the 24th day of September, 11.30 a.m., Judge Cassandra Carrier-Williams. Cuyahoga County Common Pleas Judge. Hey, y'all know you got to vote today. If you live in the city of Cleveland, you should be voting, right? There's a lot of stuff going on. The mayor's race, the councilman's race. Shout out to Bashir Jones in Ward 7. Uh, <clears throat> keeping him lifted up, praying for him. And then the two top two vote getters move on to November. So I hope you voted today. It's almost that time for we call it word power. But we're going to dedicate the rest of our show to women's season. We're going to keep asking you that question of the day. And we want you to call in. We want to make it interactive. Come I on. I just had a caller. He said, you know, it's women. Women can't be submissive because they can't lo let go of their baggage. The baggage. We bring baggage, baggage. into America. That's yes, the second like time that. around. That's for the that, second that's, time around. That's for the second like time around. Um, right. Couple that's okay. you know second in marriage has been divorced because it's baggage. it's a lot of hurt and a lot of wow. baggage. So wow. they didn't see it in the they wasn't able to do it in the first marriage and right. so then they have a spouse that's in the second marriage that right. is like that know right. how to fall under right. Right. Uh, right. be submissive to Christ okay. but but the wife can't be right I got you because she you. never she, she didn't really do it the, the first time she didn't know how to do it the first time I, I'm going to tell you why because God talks about God ordained submission in the marriage we getting ready to go into the word part I'm sorry God ordained submission and though. when he ordained submission, right. he wanted it to be in marriage because he didn't um, want the marriage right. to be in chaos. It's God ordained. It's God ordained. Like submission and is so God ordained. He says for submission, we got to talk about oh. it's it's about someone being uh it's it's an equal thing that we share. So wow. when it's not done, that means something one of us is unequally yoked. Unequally yoked. Wow, Lady V's so spitting knowledge. Shared equally. She's spitting knowledge. I just hit and that, my and knee that's on coming the chair. From the word. <laughs> that's coming from the word. Hey, we got a caller. Caller, are you there? Hey, hey how y'all doing? Oh, it may be me this time. Oh, nope, it's me this time. Oh, it's Fine. me this time. Help me out. Caller, are you there? You're live on the light, our live internet broadcast. Hey, hey, hey who is how this? How y'all doing? This is Minister Jazz. Hey, hey, Minister Jazz. You excited about women's season? Tell them how excited you are about women's season. Wow. I am so super pumped. Yes. I mean, Lady V is an awesome and annoying Praise kid. God. A woman burst in her word, and I'm just pumped. Like, I can't wait to see what she's going to bring to the table. I know it's going to be fire. And wow. I'm just all around excited. I'm excited, oh, too, because the men are going to beat y'all so bad. We're just going to beat y'all. Like, probably we're just going to beat oh, y'all no. into submission, beat y'all into the word, beat y'all into, we're just going to beat y'all. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> shout, beach. I, I think not. I think not. <laughs> Minister Jazz, you, you heard what I said earlier. You know, he had to go out and get some uh, some people who were, you know, of status. Don't but, hate a dream team. Oh, man. he you, That's exactly right. All he had to go out and, get, and create a dream team. But I'm, that's all right. I'm that's Pat okay. Riley, and that's the Miami Heat, a dream. Wow. We a dream team. Hey, Jazz, what are you expecting from the word that night from the woman of God? What are you expecting from the word? Wow, I'm really expecting something that's kind of going to uplift <coughs> me, you know, and encourage me uplift. on my journey as I grow. Yes, I heard you. Uplift, praise God. Hug those babies for us. Hug Samari. Hug baby yeah. Isaiah. How old is baby Isaiah now? All right, we getting it. We got it together. <laughs> How old is baby Isaiah before you leave? He's about to be five months. Praise wow. God. Jazz, we love your grace and peace be unto you. You yes, know you are. Thank love you for you everything too, you do at the light. That's Minister Jazz oh, Lauderdale. Well, She's in training. We got another caller. Hey, we'll hit it again. Come on, caller. Are you there? Hey, caller, you're live on the light. This Friday, you're coming to True Light Church, 1799 East 55th Street, to hear the woman of God preach the word. It's women's season. Tell them how excited you are. Oh, I'm real excited. I heard uh, Lady Lee speak. Um, 
a couple of Sundays ago, and I'm just really excited to see exactly what it is she's going to bring to the table because I know it's going to be powerful. Oh, praise, praise God. God. This is Thank our you. daughter, Tiffany. Tiffany, the kids are good and Corey's good. Yeah, everybody is fine. Praise God. You working hard? You got to work today? Uh, actually, I'm at work now, so I just took the time to call in. You know, I always make time for God. Always. Praise amen, God. Amen. Praise God. Praise amen. God. That's good. Get back to work, girl. Get back to work. Praise Ooh. God. Thank you, Tiffany. Get back to work. Say, I got. I want to share something. Oh, Apostle, come on. Um, Pastor Rosina Coles uh, says thanks again for the shout out, but she Praise says, okay. um, when you have a man of God. Woo. Yes, come on, Pastor. That you trust yes. and yes. you see like yes. Christ yes. in the flesh, you wouldn't have a problem submitting. That's right. Wow. I, I was total Pastor agreement. Pastor Rosina, praise total God. Agreement. You and me, Pastor Rosina, because we're going to take yes. him out to dinner before Bishop speaks. But that is a powerful word from the powerful woman of God, the co pastor of the lion, Pastor Rosina Coles. I can't wait to meet Lady V. Praise God. Man, that's exciting. Call us 216 298 1554. You know, our example of submission comes from Jesus Christ. Ooh, come on. Comes in John 14, 28. Oh, good word. Praise How he him. was able Praise to submit him. to God. Hit that's the good. Father. That's good. That's so that's good. where our example that's comes from. So we shouldn't, if we say we're Christians that's and, and, and Good. And we love God. Yes. We should not have a problem wow. submitting to our husband, just like Praise the God. sister just said. Pastor Rosina. Yes, Pastor Rosina just said. Right. When he's able, to, when he submits to God, we yes. should not have a problem falling yeah. up under our husband and submitting to our husband. Because what did Pastor Rosina say again, Bishop? In that text, read it to me one time. When the man of God she says, is, when you have a man of God, when you have a man that yes. you trust, trust, yes. and you see <coughs> him like Christ in the flesh. That's yes. right. You wouldn't have a problem submitting. I like that. You know, one thing that Bishop taught us right. about that word submission. Mm -hmm. Submission. Submission. Yes, sir. He broke it down like this. Right. Sub means under. Under. Yes, yes it does. Mission, mission means on a mission. Yes. Like, I like that. Like on a on mission. Assignment. On assignment. Yeah, on assignment. On a mission. If your husband right. is on an assignment Ooh. from Ooh, that's God, good. That's you good. should that's be good. able to submit yes, to that's that good. assignment. Ooh, that's Bishop, good. that's good. Yeah, that's what he taught us at that's Judah. Good. Bishop, that's good. That, that, that's, that's good teaching. Powerful, powerful Bishop teaching. Romy Cole, senior pastor of the Lion, powerful teaching the submission. So submission, what about uh, the kids? Mm. What about the kids? Absolutely. Know, what about the kids? Everybody should be on the mission. What if they never wow. seen it before? What, See, what if they... When I say that, yes, it was never in the household. It never happened in the household. So you, the, the children, especially the uh, girls, mm. young girls, mm. they never wow. seen their mother mm. come up under submission because mm. it was never there in the household. You understand what I'm saying? So I'm going to give an example. I'm going to use me. Single parent. Yourself, praise God. So I've always been in that authoritative position in my home. Praise okay? God. Okay. So that's all my girls saw. Right. So they never see me come up under submission, not even <coughs> with their dad. One, we was unequally yoked. Because mm. God says that when a person can, uh, when a couple comes into submission, that means they're equal together. So right. that means he's falling up under Christ and I'm falling up under him. But it was never like that in our home. So they gotcha. never saw that. Gotcha. So when they go into relationship, they kind of don't know how to do it because they never really saw that. Even though they heard it, like mm -hmm. I heard it in my home, mm -hmm. in, in my mom's home. Right. But... As I got older and going right. out into my own, I, right. I really didn't pay attention to that word submission or right, equally right, right. yoke. So right, I didn't okay. I didn't mm -hmm. show it to my girls how mm. it can be done. Right. So if they've never seen it, right. then how can they understand it right. to, to be able to do it? I know what right. the word says, but if we're not in relationship with the word, then we can't do it. Either. So you're talking, yeah, you're talking to the single parent or the parent who's been divorced. That's good teaching Absolutely. for the second time around. Got you. Because yeah. maybe they didn't see that model in the home. Exactly. What about the apostle? Why don't you hit it from the men's side? What about our young boys who are being raised by single parents? You know, sometimes our, our brothers tell me, Rev, I got to do this, man. I'm about that life. Mama's struggling. They see him. We don't condone it, but they go into that life. So, apostle, what about the young brothers? Does, is that Does that have an effect on them when there's no father in the home, dad's in prison, divorce, whatever the case. Dad went home to be with the Lord, whatever. How, how, how do you feel about that from a, you a know, young man's a, point of you view? Know, that's a good question, but here again. And Pastor Rosina just answered it. She says, Ooh. train up a child. Ooh, train so, up a child. So, you Pastor know, Rosina's on fire know, tonight. You're on fire. You're on so, fire. Thank you, Pastor Rosina, for joining us. We have the responsibility 
Re- to train I like that up word. a child. That's responsibility. I mean, that's a I like responsibility. That I like so, that. Okay, so if we don't have like a that. husband or we don't have a wife and we can't show them, mm-hmm. Jesus takes that place. Ooh, come on, apostle. Okay. And if I see yes, mama, sir. if I see mama right. obeying yes. the word of God, yes, like the mamas do. Mama does submit right. it to the word of Going God. Going to church, right. serving God. God. Right. Yes. Now she's Sacrificing. training me. Yes. To do that, I don't. I don't have to see a, a man in the house to learn that wow, I can submit. Praise God to God, and I, I submit to my okay. mama. Okay. Wow, Apostle, I, I mean, receive. I, I receive. Yeah, that. I receive that. Absolutely. That's that's headship. I, that's I, headship. I, I, I agree with Apostle. That that yes. man, if he sees that mama serving and that mama going to church and that mama doing the upright thing, yeah, that's that's the responsibility. And it's just the opposite because wow. if you don't see the mama serving in church and stuff like right, that, you're right, not going right. to see it. It's right. just the opposite. Right. Wow. Uh, wow. Uh, here, I just have one more comment from Rosie. Okay, come on, Pastor Rosina, stay with us. Yeah, stay with us for the whole show tonight. She's Come on, come on. In my my house, okay. He set the standard, and I backed him. Praise and God. carried on the order that my husband has set for us. Praise God. So you know, there you go. I like now, that. Okay, now the bishop chiming in. Now. Come on, Bishop Coles, you my know, main <laughs> man, Bishop Romy Coles. He says every day. Every day. You you know they obey God's commandment. Yes. Right. Yes. You know to to submit to Christ. I like that. I like that, Apostle. And, well, and Bishop. Well, and, and you know, all of us know that we have to follow yes. Pastor Aiken, yes. follow when Pastor you, as yes. they follow Christ. As they follow definitely. Christ. Exactly. She definitely, right. Exactly. I like what Rosina, Pastor Rosina said, a man a man of God that you can trust. Yes. And Bishop, I like how Bishop Coach just said, the man sets that standard, kind of like the point guard on a basketball team. And with us coming together on this second time around, we talk a lot about that. It's both our second marriage. So we talk a lot about submission, authority, uh, the word prayer, mm-hmm. uh, me being a kingdom walking and, and walking the way I should walk, and 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 Lady V helping me support me with division. So we know it's teamwork it makes the dream yeah, work. Amen. One of our slogans yeah. at the that's light: teamwork. Oh, that's what. Oh man, we got a big banner up, Bishop. You'll see it. Teamwork <laughs> makes the dream work. Yeah. Hey, it's seven thirty. Bishop Romy Coles has called in. The senior pastor of the Lion, his beautiful wife, Pastor Rosina Coles, the co-pastor. She's called in, and my main man, Apostle Larry James. James is with us, the owner of KAZ Radio, and my girl, my brown sugar girl, my mm-hmm. Coretta, my Winnie, my Michelle, my sugar honey, Ice Tea is with me, Lady V. All roads lead to the church this Friday. What time, Lady V? At 7 p.m. 7 p.m. is women's season at the light. They're going to be repping their t-shirts, women's season at the light. We got to tell you about it. It's the power of love. From Ephesians 4 to his women's season at the light. Hey, let's keep on flowing. It's 7.30. We not out of we definitely not out of time. Excuse me, I got this little scratchy throat. I'm dealing with it. I'm doing the water, doing the little vitamin thing. I'm trying to get that together. I thank God I don't got to preach Friday or Sunday. Praise the Lord. <laughs> so check this out. Submission. I want to go back to it. I hope uh, Pastor Rosina stays with us and Bishop Cole stays with us. Um, submission. Now, can I be misled when I submit? So we got to hit that side. Can I be misled when I submit? Some women, I, I know I had a, a woman ask me this in counseling. She's not quite sure if her husband is making the right decision. Is that a problem? He's the head, but she says, Pastor, I can't submit to that because I just don't think that's right. Is that unequally yoked? Do they got to pray together? Wait a minute. They said they prayed together. Lady V, Pastor Rosina, help me with that. I had a, a, a woman tell me that in counseling. She said it's kind of hard to submit. She's not saying he's a bad guy. He's, he's got Holy Ghost field and all that, but she thinks he's making the wrong decision. What do you do then as a wife? Hmm. I like what Ro- Pastor Rosita Cole said she, when she said if he's resembling Christ. Resembling Christ. She did say that. She said trust and resembling. Then right? it's not going to be, it shouldn't be hard for her to trust him in the decisions that he made. Even the decision is like, you know, she used this analogy, you know, we're, we're men. when we, we won't follow directions and we go down the wrong road and y'all tell us you turn left, you shouldn't and we'll go all the way down to the then we'll have to come <laughs> back. That's the analogy she used because you know, and we do that. We're carrying a, a big old bag and I say, oh, I got it, I got it knowing I need help with it. So that's the analogy she used with me. So again, Lady V, if you think he's, if I'm making, is that, that's not unequally yoked, I don't think. So I need, so what do you think, Apostle? Well, well first of all, we submit to one another. Yes. Okay. Okay. Right. So right. sometimes if if I do something that my, my honey yeah. doesn't yeah, totally. right. agree with. <laughs> right. All right. Um, How does she respond? Do you see her not she, being submissive? Or? She gets quiet. 
There you go. That's the, she gets oh, quiet. That's what I do quiet. too. Yes, yeah. <laughs> which, I do that now. <laughs> makes me think. Which makes you think. That's okay. right. I heard uh-huh. that, Apostle. So I, I heard, heard that. That's good. Heard that. And then because we pray together every day. Right. So we got to pray. She has a way of praying because we mm. pray together. Oh, that's right. Mm. Praise Lord God. Lord help him. You know? Lord help him. <laughs> Lord help that child. I mean, she's not that bad. <laughs> yeah, that's but, right. Lord but, help him. But, you know, it, it's a right. prayer thing. It's it's like the war room. It's, yeah. Yeah, the war room. Okay. Astray, mm-hmm. Right. That's good. You can intercede. Pray. Yeah, I mean, God you listens to your prayer, prayer just as much yeah. as your husband, right? Yes. Praise God. Yes. yes. Apostle, that's really good. Yeah, so yeah, that prayer. Good. Number one, you got to pray. Lady V, what do you think? So when he's making the... Ah, that decision's not right. And you know, like you said, you'll get quiet like Lady Jane does. I do do that. I do right. that with you now. Yeah, you do that now. She and, does. And I, and I just pray. And I'm like, he, he gonna, he, he'll he get it in a minute. He'll get it. Okay, so he'll intercessory in prayer. Intercessory prayer. Yeah. Pastor Rosina, are you still there? Call us up and let us know. We want your input if you're available and you can still do it at 733 on the Lord's Day. Give out that number. Hey, give out that number again. 216-298. One five five four. We're live in the powerful anointed studio of KAZ Radio TV. Two one six two nine eight one five five four. Call us. Come on. Tiffany says something. She wants me to read it off, but she's at work. She better get back to work. Tiffany says, <laughs> well, I told her, girl, you better get rendering to Caesar with Caesar's. Now you got to get, get to work. Don't be doing that. Mm. Well, some women have a problem with authority because of pride. I think that's, that's what true. Tiffany says. There's a young sister uh, who's uh, getting ready to get married. Her and Corey getting ready. She's uh, uh, engaged and all that good stuff. Yeah, pride will do it. Pride goes before the fall. Don't have that pride, ladies. Praise God. I think when a powerful couple are together and the anointed God rest rules and abide and they're into their word and fellowship, uh, ministering to one another. I like what Apostle said. And I love what Pastor Rosina says. That trust factor is powerful. Well, some women have a, a problem falling under submission because they men, I have a text saying that, they abuse the word what about submission. The, oh, they abuse. Who abuses the word submission? The man. The man. Ooh, so do. Yeah, let's talk to me and Apostle. Does the man abuse the sub? Uh, yeah, that I can see that. I can see a man that abusing submission. that submission, like being uh, forceful. What about in relationship? The body is not your own in sexual relationship. So the body says that can sometimes a man be overbearing in that. I think you be careful, brothers, with the submission. I think too much is given, much is required. Caller, are you there? We got a caller. What Apostle said, and I love what Pastor Rosalie hey, said. That, that is me. Factor. I don't have to be the well, person until 8 o'clock, but mm-hmm. I uh, will say, say this okay. um, about being uh Committee Come on. Okay. Come on, daughter Tiffany. You said you don't, you don't have to be to work to eight o'clock, so you ain't in trouble. Women, All right. Being su- being submissive. Okay. To God, with to Jesus, which He's the head of the church. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then why can we not be submissive to our husband, who is the head of the house? Oh, good, Tiffany. Good. Why can't we then be submissive this to our is, husband, who's the head of the house? All this right. Is, wow, this Tiffany. Is, it's just like I said earlier, some women have a problem with authority because of their uh, pride. Because mm, mm. of pride, if yes. you and your husband is walking into one, and you and your husband is uh, with Christ, yes. then it should not be a yeah. reason or it shouldn't be hard for a woman to obey her husband. <laughs> So like if that. he says, well, babe, I don't think you should buy those pair of shoes. You should You buy just it. be like, okay, you right. know what? He's right. Wow. I don't need these pair of shoes. Praise God. Tiffany, thank you. That's powerful. That's my daughter, Tiffany. We got another caller. We want everybody to get in. Caller, are you there? Yes, I'm there. Praise God. Who am I speaking Hi, with? Pastor Coles. How you doing? Hey, Pastor Coles. I'm great. Praise God. Hey. Thank you for hanging with us. Thank you for calling in. I can't wait for you to meet Lady V. Thank you. But chime in on that. So now um, give me your input on that. Um, one of the things, I mean, I didn't really hear what Tiffany said, but um, one of the things, you know, that I've always been taught, even through the word, my pastors, even my husband being a pastor. Praise God. You know, I mean, you learn to submit. I mean, you build this relationship with him. You trust him, as I said previous. You trust the God in him. Mm. Even when he may make mistakes, you pray. Yes. You pray God give him wisdom and mm. understanding mm. that that he lead the family the right way. Yes. Mm. And that I don't have a like even in our family, I don't have a problem submitting Praise with God. my um to my husband. Amen. First Praise of all, God. I see the fruit of his life. Yes. yes. I see how he loves God. Yes. I see how he obeys God. Wow. So it's not a problem to submit. I see how he led the flock. 
the right. way he has led it. So yes. submission is not an issue. Wow. Do we have challenges? Of course, yes. Yes. But at the end of the day, I trust the God that's in him. Yes. Praise God. I like Amen. that you trust the God that's in him. And I like how you say in the family and with the church as he leads his family and then as he leads the church. That's just that's just shout out to uh, Bishop Romy Coles. That's powerful. Yes. And I want to applaud you, Pastor Coles, for just being obedient to your husband and, and serving and, you know, and doing ministry work. I told Lady V how much I admire you guys and she can't wait to meet you guys. I've told her about my covenant relationship with you guys. And I just think that's awesome to hear you as a woman of God. Uh, say coming up under submission is easy. Yes. Praise God. Amen. Praise Amen. God. Pastor Rosina, yeah, thank we've you. Been, we've been together. We've been married 21 years. So praise God. You know, the word is working. The word is work. It is 21 it's, years. And we are celebrating starting this Friday, oh, Saturday, wow. and Sunday. Oh, okay. Their church anniversary oh, and wow. their wedding anniversary. Praise, so, praise God. God. Okay. We'll come over Saturday. We can't be there Friday, Pastor Coles. Please tell Bishop, but Saturday we'll be there. 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock. 7 o'clock. Come on. I appreciate it. All right. Pastor well, Coles. Look forward to meeting you, Lady D. You too, as well. God bless. Oh, Pastor Coles, thank God you for bless. calling us in. Thank you for supporting us on the air. Take care. Praise Bye -bye. God. Take care. Pastor Rosinia Coles, co-pastor of the Lion under Bishop Romy Coles. Thank God for that. Hey, callers, if we still got time, it's 740. We're dedicating the show to women's season. It's women's season at the light. They're going to be rocking the T-shirts. I'll put them up again. There they are, the beautiful T-shirts on the back, the female ministry, soul, seeds of a woman. And then we got the cards and everything ready to go. It's the power of love. Women's season 2017 at the light. We're kicking it off this Friday at 7 p.m. Hey, shout out again to everybody at the Lions. Support your pastors. Pastors, they're gonna, you said it's the church anniversary and their wedding anniversary. 21 years of marital bliss. And how old is the Lion Church? All y'all show up. Praise God at the Lion Church. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, Apostle Cole said the 15th, 16th, and 17th. Amen. Callers, check us out. 216 298 one five five four what's the question of the day lady v is it hard to submit is it hard to submit that submission pastor rosina knocked that ball out the park she said it's easy man praise god so thank god the kids apostle hit on the man side the young boys being raised in the home maybe without a a, a dad in the home but seeing a christ-like mom lady v hit it with the single woman being in the home raising apostles right we have a responsibility to train yeah. up a child in the right, right way man. hey we're excited we got to give you our lineup one more time this friday is 2017 women's season lady v's gonna kick it off she's the lead off hitter Number two, <laughs> Derek Jeter. Number two, Derek Jeter. All my sports fans know what I'm talking about. The captain, Derek Jeter. That's how they would introduce wow. Derek Jeter, the Yankees, <laughs> the great Yankee. He would lead it off, girl. So I'm, I'm, I'm leading it off. The lady, Lady V, leading it off. So she's going to kick it off on Friday night <laughs> at 7 p.m. at the light. 1799 East 55th Street. The first 50 women get a special gift. And then... If you tell me you listen to us, you watch us on radio or television, you come on in and say, I saw the broadcast live on KAZ Radio TV. I got a special gift for the lady, man. You're going to love it. I'll be in the hallway to foyer greeting every lady that comes in. My ministers will be with me and my deacons. We're going to, man, we're going to make it a special night for the women. Then the next Friday, come back again. September 22nd, 7 p.m., Elder Danielle Dorch from Dunham Christian Church is our guest speaker. And then we culminate on Sunday, September 24th at 11.30 a.m. with Judge Cassandra Carrier williams Cuyahoga County Common Pleas Judge. We had a powerful lineup. The scriptorial theme is Ephesians 4.2. Got to back it up with the word. The word in the beginning was the word and the word was with God. Hey, I got to do this. I would be remiss if I didn't at 741 on the Lord's Day, Tuesday, September 12th. We can't let a broadcast go by without you accepting Jesus Christ yes. as your Lord and Savior. All you have to do is believe that Jesus Christ lived and died and God raised him from the dead and you are saved. Then you get into a Bible-believing, Bible-teaching church, get baptized on a profession of your faith, go to your ministry classes, do your assessment test, and then find out where you're going to serve, man. Stay on the wall like Nehemiah. Check this out right now if you're watching this broadcast. 
and you're not saved, sanctified, filled with the Holy Ghost, we want you to accept Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior. Believe Jesus Christ live. Believe God Almighty raised him from the dead and believe he sits on the right hand of the Father and he filled us with the Holy Ghost. He said, I'm going to leave, but I'm going to send the comforter and he's going to come back, man. We got it's all about Jesus, man. Somebody think Smokey Norfolk said, uh, can't nobody do me like Jesus was that Smokey <laughs> Norfolk song. I love it by Smokey Norfolk. Help me, Lady V. He said something about that. Jesus. That wasn't it. What did he say? Can't nobody do you like Jesus? Can't nobody. I'm going to get it. Smokey Norfolk. It's going to come to my mind. It's all about Jesus, man. Get saved. Get sanctified. Call her. No, 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 actually, you have a request. A request. Someone needs a ride to church. Uh, wow. Dominique Marie Bailey. Dominique Marie Bailey, we're going to pick you up. We're going to get your number. And yes, girl, we're going to pick you up and bring you to the light. Dominique, one of my spiritual daughters, praise the Lord. Oh, that's Pray. Awesome. She follows us on Facebook. She follows our radio ministry, our live internet ministry. She follows the television ministry on Time Warner Cable. Yes, daughter, we will pick you up. We're going to get your number and you call call Jazz. I think you've got Jazz's number. Call the church. 216-417-0749 and yes we will pick you up for Friday night and for Sunday God bless your daughter that's a blessing praise God thank God hey we're live and we still got a little time Lady V is 743 we're live in the studios of KAZ Radio TV hey for that non-believer Jesus said and you know I'm talking about I'm switching gears watch this apostle I'm messing with somebody and they watching Jesus told Thomas you doubting again, man. But when he came, he showed him his hands and his and his fingers and all that good stuff. So KAZ has 25 cent advertising and they know who I'm talking to. They said, no, that's not true. It's got to be twenty five dollars. Log on www.kazradiotv and my main man, Apostle Larry James, the owner, is the home of the 25 cent advertisement. There it is. Praise God. We always have fun. <laughs> I can't say no names, but they drilled me after the broadcast last Tuesday and Wednesday. They said, oh, that can't be true. He's a man of God. Man of God, you got to walk by faith, not by sight. You I know, I mess with my buddy. He, says, he said, why is it women? He said, women it says it's hard because they men have the mentality to say, do as I say. Ooh, there it is. Not do as I say something like yeah. that, that authoritative thing that turns people off. Oh, it's do what I say and don't speak over me as Ooh, a man. And, and he said men have to respect Ooh. the women also. Definitely, brother. You got to respect, man. It's about <laughs> R-E-S-E-P-C-T. Did I spell it right? Like Aretha said, you got to respect. We can't do it, Apostle. Yeah. Let's ask Apostle too. Can we do it in a dominating way? Don't No disrespect. You can't be doing the Ike Turner. Uh, <laughs> come on. Come on, man. Like Randy Moss said last night in my on, Randy man. Moss, come on, man. Right, yeah, right. you can't be doing that, man. No, Don't you, can't. Uh, you can't put your hands on a woman. You shouldn't right, talk crazy right. to a woman. Their worth is far above rubies. That's I read right. in the word. And they, right. they carry life and birth life into the world. That's right. Man, I love that about. Shout out to my mama in glory. Yes. Can, when we say that, can they hear us in glory? I think they can, can't they? You know, I don't think they're paying as much attention up here down here in glory. That's yeah. right, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I, think I like that. Time, I like that, Apostle. Hey, I see y'all when y'all get, yeah. yeah. get here. Yeah, see you on the other side. Right. They, 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 they were the right. elders are praising God. Yes. Remember, I said the 24 yeah. elders are praising on, God yes. and the choir singing yes. Hallelujah. Yeah, hallelujah. You right, yeah. praise yeah. God. 745, Lady V, we got a little time. Tell me, just a, give me a snippet of what you're going to preach about. When you go to the movie theaters and Apostle James is going to... Uh, <laughs> He's going to uh, bend your arm a little bit, too. When you go to the movie theaters to see the feature movie, they always show you snippets of uh, of what's happening. They show a you trailer. a trailer. A trailer. Yeah, a trailer. I know trailer Apostle. Piece. Apostle, trailer give us a trailer piece of the message. Ephesians 4 2. Ephesians 4 2. Ephesians 4 2. Okay. <laughs> Ephesians 4 2. If you wanna, okay. All right. Ephesians 4 2. We're going to look it up. Ephesians 4 2. Ephesians 4 2. All right. I mean, it, you want to tell us more than that. You want to tell us more than that, don't no, you? Of course yeah. not. Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> it says, be completely humble. And gentle. Apostle, and listen to audience, I think that's because she's fearful of men's season when we kick it off October wow. the 1st. October the 1st, men's season. Actually, I just don't want you to steal none of my stuff. Oh, oh. oh that's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Pastor Rosina, you got to come out and help your girl, your, your new girl, because the men, we're going to, the month of October, we're going to just, they're going to be submissive wow. in October. I'm, I'm fear, no, it says, be completely humble. Okay. And gentle. Yes. Be patient. Be patient. Bearing with one another. Yes. In love. In love. The power of love. In the easy to read Bible, but, it says always be humble, gentle, be patient, mm -hmm. accepting other with love. No, wait, 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 wait. Verse one. We got to go back to verse two. You can't okay. understand two if All you right. don't read, read one. one. Read one. It says, 
as a prisoner mm. for the Lord, then mm. I urge you to Ooh. live a life. I, yes. I urge you to live a wow. life worthy mm. of the calling you have received. Oh, wow. That's being a representative <coughs> of Christ. Mm. Women. The power of love. All women. All single women. women. Single women. Divorced women. Married women. Married women. Husband went on to be with the Lord, women. Widow. Widow woman. There it is. Praise God. Are you a representative of Christ? A representative of Christ. Yeah. And if so, do you have a humble spirit? A humble spirit. You a preaching. patient spirit. Wow, you preaching. A now gentle spirit. Oh, you preaching. A spirit women. that bears with one another Ooh. in love. You preaching the text. I'm just telling you. Wow. But you got to come out. Friday. I like that. That was a and snippet. Hear the rest of yeah. it. I no. think Apostle has no, something jump in there. Can, can you help me with something? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Why that was good. It, why is it? Wow. Some of my sisters. Mm. My sisters. My sisters. Okay. The sisters. You know they got the neck roll. Oh, oh man. They got the, the argumentative. Yeah. Mm. Right. Now I'll mm. fight you. You roll. know, just mm. plain. Yucky. <laughs> Not a lot possible. But but Ooh. but why why are they that way? And I'm not talking about the ones in the world. You're talking I'm about talking the about the ones in Christ. Christ. In Christ. You yeah. know what? We was ha we wow. had that conversation on in the way Christ. down here. Wow. And we had it a couple of days ago. We remember mm. we was on the porch. Wow. We were talking, and I said to experience the power of love, God's mm -hmm. love. Mm -hmm. You you have to understand. Love. Gotta First of all, you got to understand that God is love. God is love. Okay. He created us too. Right. To have all this love. Okay. So we gotta, we got to mm, understand love. We don't understand love. So a lot of us have that. That's why they roll their neck like roll that. Roll their neck okay. mentality or and that yuck. Well, well, that yuck. Said that yuck. It, I think they haven't been loved. And let me let me explain what I mean. I was going Ooh, there. Yeah, okay, yeah, let me yeah, finish. Okay, right. and, they right. have, and, they, right. and they haven't, they haven't been, been loved. loved. Godly love, rightly, godly love. Right, we right. they experience right the worldly. That's not enough. That's oh, not. No. That's, that's not, not what's, love at all. what's going to su all sustain all. you. Mm -hmm. Worldly right. love is not going to sustain you because that's why we go in and out of love. Worldly wow. love, right? right. But right. when you ex truly experience and fully understand the power mm. of God's love, love. come on. Mm, the power of God. You, you gotta love. know God loves you. You, do. Yes, you gotta yes. know He loves you. You gotta know that. The Son mean, died. No for matter us. what. Right. You gotta know that. Yeah. No matter what you have done. Right. God still loves. God still That's loves. Good, us. God still God, loves God, us. It said God is love. No matter what That's you've what done. No matter where you've been. No matter where you've been. No matter what you've been no through. No matter what your status is. No matter what your status. No matter what you have done in life. No. God God's loves you. It's that agape love. Yeah. Unconditional. That unconditional love. Like the prodigal father had for the son. Yes. He, he went out to the road every day to make sure his son was coming. He went out and looked for his son every day. Remember, every morning he went to see, and one day that boy came back home. I, I, wow. I, we, we have that. We find temporary love. Ooh, you temporary love. Mm. Temp agency love. Yeah, we find temporary love. Temporary love. We do. Talk about that real That's, quick. Temporary no, love. Then you, you try to give me a <laughs> we, we find temporary love. <coughs> and that mm. temporary love only Fish. sustains us for a moment. Temporary Pastor love. For Rosina a season. Says, Ooh. Pastor Rosina Pastor Rosina says, Come on. Some, some of y'all sisters All right. are on the defense. They on the defense. They I can on tell. The defense. They on the defense. Yes, Instead Pastor Rosina, you're right. The offense, they on the yeah. defense. They on the defense. Stop yes. fighting. Come on. Come on, that's get on the offense. Came, ooh, that's why Come we on, girl. The, the real love that God has for us. Because you're on the defense. Because we're always on the defense. And stop saying, I don't want no man. Yes. Oh, when Whoa, the Christian my sisters. Goodness. Oh, apostle, since I've been to Christ. I don't Christ, need a man. Oh, I don't need a man. And they always say. I got a, a PhD. Say, I got a, I, um, I'm I in love go, with God. I'm in love with God. Do you really know what that means to be in love with God? Wow. Because God doesn't want us not to have somebody. Come on. Adam got lonely. On the opposite. Yeah, he needed a he, help. God mate. created Eve, Come right? On. Right. Mm. Oh, Jesus. Well, I'm just saying. Well, well, now, sister, though, the, the comment I used to hear back in the day when what? I was dating sisters. Wait, 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 oh, okay. What was it? What was it, Apostle? And they be acting up. What they okay. say? God know my heart. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah oh, that's, she talks about that. Oh, yeah. God, God, God know, know my heart. heart. He, he do, do know it. 
Yeah, he does. Yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> By Jupiter's. Ooh, Jesus, he know your heart. He looks I at the heart. heart. Yeah, he don't yeah, look he at does. the outward appearance. He doesn't. Shout out to David. He Whoa, don't look at the outward. He looks at the heart. Wow, Apostle's right about that. So at 7.52, mm. we're going to run out of time, never out of context. Those are some good trailers. Uh, Jazz said, Minister Jazz, she's hitting us up late. She said, preview, LOL. She keeping that thing in. So Jazz said you're going in. That's the young people. You know how they talk. Yeah, man. So there it is, man. So check out those are some good trailers. I like those trailers. Women's season at the light this Friday. And then at the Lion, they're celebrating the church anniversary and Bishop and Pastor Cole's anniversary, wedding anniversary. So we got a lot jumping off. This Friday, 7 p.m. at the light, 1799 mm. East 55th Street. We kick off women's season with Lady V. She's going to rock the house. The ladies are in their t-shirts and jeans. They're going to be rocking it. I think she told them, you told them to, you can come as you are, but they rocking the t-shirts, jeans, jeans and, and the Tims. Tims. They're going to be them. rocking it. Yeah. You they don't go, have them still come as you are. Come, come as you are. Uh, yeah. Tennis yeah. shoes. Praise God. Your flip flops. Oh, the men. Can the men come? A caller asked me that. You know what? I want the come? men to come because yeah. I want them to show us that yes. there, there are covering right there. Ooh, that's good. The and I want them to surround us and, and encourage and us. And so you can see how we're going to beat y'all in and, October and, when men's season starts. Wow. wow. Again, just a covering. <laughs> That's it. We're going to beat them in October for <laughs> men's season. Covering. The lineup for October. October the 1st, Pastor Greg Manigault from the Wild Wild West Side, the mm. remnant house of God. He preaches like Bishop Jakes. September then 15th, Bishop, Lady V. Woo! Then Bishop <laughs> Eric King K. Clark. <laughs> and then Bishop Romy Coe on October Elder 27th. Danielle. Wow. Shout and then out. Fox on Wayne Dawson. Oh, my gosh. October 29th, Apostle. Really? Yeah. Really? She'll be a little sad when she comes to the studios that first wow. Monday, that first Tuesday in October. You think so? Yeah. I but we're going to pray. Pastor Rosina going to help you out. She got you covered in prayer. She's going to intercede. Praise Needs God. It. It's the light, the live internet broadcast for True Light, live in the powerful mm. station right here on the lake. Man, we hear the jets out there going by. We're right on the lake. www.kazradio.tv, home of the 25 cent advertisement. You know, I got to keep plugging that, Apostle. <laughs> My man said, they can't be. Apostle's giving me thumbs up. <laughs> we walk by faith, not by sight. Apostle told me, home of the 25 cent advertisement. If you want to advertise your business, your ministry, real talk, what you got going on. Maybe you got an anniversary coming up, church anniversary, pastor appreciation, uh, business. Uh, whatever you want to advertise, you're launching a new business. Hey, hook up with my main man, Apostle James. Log on to www.kzradiotv, home of the 25 cent advertisement. It's 754 in the city. Y'all know I got to hit it and see what the Indians doing. It better refresh or I got to get the score. We got to get a score. The Indians game at 755. They're going for oh, 1 0. Cleveland's up 1 0. We just ended the second inning. At the bottom of the second, 1 0. My man, Corey Kluber, is going to hold it down. They're going for win number 20. Lady V, who had 20 wins? Oakland A's. Praise God. And when did they do it? 2005. Xavier, your girl knows sports. She's my sidekick. She's my Sage Steel. <laughs> ESPN. Bum, 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 bum. Shout out to the football season. It started all my fantasy football leaguers. Man, you got to get it going on. I will. Lord willing, and the creek don't rise. Next <laughs> Tuesday, I'm going to be repping my Antonio Brown Steelers jersey. Now, you know, I'm the biggest Cleveland fan. Browns, Cavs, Indians. Apostle knows that. Lady V knows that. Everybody knows that. But I lost the bet. So I got to be a man of my word. I told you I was running a little late today to the studios. But Ray, Derek, Stevie J, I'll be repping AB. And guess who got AB in the Fantasy League for the second year in a row? I get my man AB. 11 catches, 182 yards. That's for my fantasy footballers. It's 756. Lady V, tell us a little bit more about women's season. When, when you preach before we go, we got a couple of minutes. 756, and we got to tell them goodbye. Pastor. <laughs> Don't be afraid now. I'm not afraid. When October's coming now, it's just a matter of time. On September 15th. All right. 2017. That's right. At 7 p.m. I hear you. Come out to the light. You better ask Pastor Rosina to help you. <laughs> she needs some help, Pastor Rosina. Because we're going to beat them. We're going to be A submissive. message about the power of God's love coming from Ephesians 4, 2. 
Oh, wow. Praise God. That's it's it. It's women's season at the light. <laughs> hey, that's our show. It's 756. I guess we are. This time we're out of context. I didn't went down the list. We didn't <laughs> did everything. Thank all the callers who called in. Big shout out to Pastor Rosina Coles from The Lion for calling in and watching the broadcast. And hey, everybody who watched the broadcast, we love you. Pastor Bishop Coles called in too. Thank God. Thank God for Apostle James helping us. Wait a minute, I got to tell y'all, Facebook, Robert Aiken. Antoine told me I got to get this right. Facebook, Robert Aiken. Follow me, like us. Instagram, Pastor underscore Aiken. Twitter, at Pastor Aiken. Apostle, I, I think I got it right. Antoine just texted me. Robert Aiken, Facebook. True Light Church, Facebook. We got True Light Church, Facebook. Pastor underscore Aiken, Instagram. At Pastor Aiken is uh, Twitter. There it is. Keep track of us. There it is. We're out of time. And we did have some more context. Peace and love and joy to the family. In the words of Bishop Eric King K. Clark, don't take no wooden nickels. Mary hey, Mary you said, just say Gucci. Mary Mary said, get the shackles off your feet. <laughs> I just want to praise them. I just want to praise them. Search high and low. Looked all over. Just Can't say find Gucci. nobody greater. Nobody. <laughs> the young people at True Light told me to tell y'all. Gucci. Gucci. <laughs> <laughs>